Hi guys, how's it going? My name is Annie Faye. For those of you that don't know me, for those of you that do, hello, welcome back. Thank you for joining me again. As promised, I am back with another fall haul. Today's haul is from Zara. You guys know I love Zara, especially for fall pieces. I feel like in the fall they is when they really do their like best work. Um, I actually keep checking back on the website, which is always a mistake because I'm so tempted to place another order, but I actually can't like my visa took a hit, so I'm really trying to restrain myself. Anyway, um, you might see another haul, you might not, but for now, let's get into this one. So the first piece I have to show you is this oversized plaid blazer. I did pick this up in an extra small and it does fit, but I do wish it was a little bit more oversized. I really love like a big blazer. So if you're also into that look, I do recommend sizing up. And I love blazers, especially in the fall. They're so easy to style, so easy to dress up or down. As you can see here, I have it styled with a matching skirt. I've actually been wanting a matching set like this for so long. So when I saw this on the website, I just had to pick it up. This is just called the plaid mini skirt. Again, I picked this up in an extra small and this actually fits perfectly, which I was a little bit surprised to find because I feel like usually their bottoms fit me kind of weird, but I really love the skirt. Like it's got this like curved hem at the bottom, which I find really interesting. I love that little detail. It's also comfortable. It doesn't ride up too much. Um, a lot of the times with mini skirts, I find that is a huge issue and I just love it with the matching blazer. I feel like a matching set like this is so cute in the fall. And I styled the set with these loafers here. These are called the Lug Soul Loafers and I actually really, really liked these. The Zara has a bunch right now, but these were my favorite. I just really like the sole, how it's like a little bit more chunky. I picked these up in a six and a half and they fit perfectly. In terms of comfort, I'm not really sure how comfortable they are because I haven't worn them out yet, but I am gonna be doing a video styling these loafers um, next week, I think. So if you wanna find out if they're comfortable or not, you can check back in then. All right, next up is this double-faced jacket. I got this in a small because I wanted it to be a bit oversized, but um, I feel like I definitely could have went up maybe another size. It's not quite as oversized as I wanted it to be, but it still looks good. While this is really beautiful, like I love the like suede and the like woolly inside, it's beautiful. Um, I don't know how I feel about the color in person. I feel like when I saw it online, I liked the color better. I was actually looking through the website and found another really similar coat, but I feel like the color is nicer. I'm gonna insert it here so you guys can see. Let me know what you guys think. Should I exchange this one for this one? Here I have it styled with some straight leg jeans. They've got a cute little slit to show off the booties underneath. I went with a black shoulder bag to match and then just a black little crop top underneath. The jeans are actually also from Zara, but I picked them up a couple of months ago. They are amazing, you guys. I tried to find the link for you, but I think they're sold out. But if they come back in, I'll update the description because they're amazing. All right, I feel like a lot of you guys are gonna be excited about this next piece. Here are some leather pants I picked up. I believe these are called the Full Length Faux, the 90s leather pants, really long name there. I've been trying to find dupes for the Aritzia Molina pants and I feel like these are pretty similar for a fraction of the price. The vegan leather feels honestly just as nice as the Aritzia one. I know a lot of places it doesn't feel good at all. Like I went to Oak and Fort the other day and I was just like feeling their like leather blazers and stuff and it just does not feel good. This is very soft. It's very nice to the touch. Like I said, they are kind of similar to the Molinas. They're a straight leg. Um, the only thing that's different here, I would say, is that I picked up the 26, which is the smallest size. I wish they did have a smaller size because I feel like personally that would fit me better. Um, I do like the Molinas because of how snug they are and like tight on my waist. These are a little bit loose, but I'm thinking of getting one of those like buttons from Amazon, you know, the ones, and um, just like putting it putting it here so that I can make them a little bit tighter. On to the next piece. This is the straight cut blazer with pockets. First of all, this shade of green is, it's very like Bottega green, you know? I'm really feeling that right now for fall. I picked this up in an extra small. I love the fit. It's perfectly oversized. Here I just threw it on top of those leather pants. I've got that black crop underneath, some sneakers to match the color, and I think this is stunning. It also comes with a matching mini skirt and I didn't pick it up because I was like, okay, how often am I really gonna wear this like very green set? But what do you guys think? Should I get it? 
not me starting the video saying I really can't make another Zara order and yet asking you guys if I should make another Zara order. And because I love the Bottega Green oh so much, you know I just had to pick up a purse in the same color. Now this purse was kind of expensive for a Zara purse, I'm not gonna lie, but you guys know the other Zara bags that are like very similar. Hold on, I have one in pink, I'll, I'll show you. Okay, so they also have this style of shoulder bag in that same green, but like comparing the two, they might look really similar on camera, but in person, I'm not gonna lie, this one does look a lot more expensive. Just like the details here, the way the leather feels, even the way the chain strap looks, you can definitely tell that this is more expensive. Cause I was debating between just getting this one in the green or this one. Um, I am glad I went with this option because I just feel like this is gonna be a purse I'm gonna wear a lot in the fall. So like I just want it to be a little bit better quality, you know? But if you do wanna do this on a budget, they have this in green. I think it's like 40 bucks. Okay, and I have one more item to show you guys. And it is these shimmery sling back heels. Can you guys just see the shine? I don't know if you can. Oh, oh how cute. Again, I picked these up in a six and a half. I do feel like I could have went up a half size though. They are a little bit snug, but these are just so beautiful. I feel like they're a perfect holiday shoe. You know, when I think of the holidays and like a holiday party, it's always something shimmery for some reason. And these are perfect. I am wondering if I made a mistake with the color. So as you can see, I picked them up in black, but they do come in this like beautiful gold color. While I was placing my order, I was like, okay, should I just get the black? Like it's more practical, I could style them more. But now I'm having second thoughts. What do you guys think? Please let me know. And I didn't really have anything from this haul to style them with. So here I'm wearing them with this white fox dress. It is beautiful. If you haven't seen my white fox haul from last week, check that out, I'm gonna link it up here. And that is actually everything for today. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It helps me out a lot. Feel free to leave me a comment down below. I love chatting with you guys in the comments. If you liked this vibe, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.